We got some songs for you. Yay! Yay! That's that's how Nickelodeon works. That's, like, that's, that's how you train a Nickelodeon executive. Yay! Hey, we have some songs. Go up, up here, up here, up here, up here. Look, 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 look. Yeah, yeah. We're like a wife beater with like stains on it. Yeah. Ooh. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to uh, Scuffed Realtor. Scuffed Realtor. Featuring Nick Roachford, Chris Lynch, and a special guest tonight. We have Eric. We have Eric Hayden. Eric Hayden. Eric Hayden's here, guys. Pump me up. Come on, guys. Hold on. It's Eric Hayden's here, guys. What do you get there? How are you? Um, iridescent. Iridescent. Oh uh, shit. Just geodesic, opalescent. This is uh, I don't trust it. I thought I did. I thought I liked it. Let me see the weight of this thing. Damn. There you go. Check it out. <laughs> now the little old lady that was holding it to me, she was like, "I bought this <laughs> when." My Herbert and I. And I was like, yeah, I was like, uh, hold it, like, hold it like her. Like this. And I was like, oh, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, I like that. So it's orange. Yeah, I like that. Be, orange. Be careful with it. No, no. Well, like this? <laughs> and I was like, well, oh, <laughs> shut up, bitch. No, Take a piss in here. It's a no, piss jar. No fumble. Heavy? Yeah, Chris, check it out. Yeah. There you go. Oh, interesting. Opalescent. Mm. Geo, geodesic. Can you do this on with it? Yeah, you can spin it on your <laughs> finger. Right, here you go. Yeah. Oh, lady, look, it's your husband's. Oh, what? Oh, I was gonna hack you. Will it hack? <laughs> That's always my test. Ah! So. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> you just shaped my car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, can I football it to Chris's car? Can I football it to Chris's car? You know, you gotta bond it. You <laughs> Damn, that's like perfect <laughs> throwing on my car. I want to see a spiral. <laughs> shit. Oh shit. Uh, what the hell did you do? I, that was like the that was like a cartoon uh, sound oh effect. Oh my god. Oh my god. god. That's what his kids look like? <laughs> Pile of bugs. <laughs> oh now I know. Oh my son! <laughs> you think you got any room for my son on your baseball team? It's a pile of oh, bugs. Oh now I know who you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, Rick Owens. <laughs> oh I was saying Rick Owens. Rick Owens is the like these sneakers. This guy. Yep. Oh, he looks good. Yeah, he's a good guy, right? He's got this. You're, um, I saw no. him in Last Action Hero. And then this is his wife. Oh my god. <sighs> she wore a he uh, a cut out of his head. What is going what? on? Why what? What? You don't have any of those guys on the construction site? She can get away with it though. She's pretty hot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> she can do anything with that. Did body. you ever post that video anywhere of when we were me and the older? Uh... Yeah. The, the eclipse day? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Oh yeah, people were inferring that you were hooking up with the old woman. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. But yeah, no, his son um is pile of bugs. <laughs> I, I like to think about Rick Owens um like pleading to a baseball coach on getting his son on the team, but <laughs> it's just like come on, he's got a good swing. No, nah, he's into it. I mean I, I can't let the kid down. <laughs> <laughs> like you look over, like this is his son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dad, it's talking like. It's gotta be something you can use him for. <laughs> Dad, what did he say? Can I play outfield? <laughs> I'll do anything. I'll be a bad boy if I have to. He, that's him rubbing his son's head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's somehow many, but also one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, he speaks perfectly good English and sounds like a bo like a boy son. He can fly. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, son, head up to bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give, give, give daddy kisses. Give kisses good night. We'll see you in the morning. Get ready for school. <laughs> Larvae. <laughs> that hallway doesn't look too legit. Um, yeah, what's that? Twenty-four inches. <laughs> <laughs> you see that? You just look like you're, you're, you're the someone in the family is fucking five hundred and eleven. Yeah, pounds. it's like, can I go upstairs? Like, I don't know, can you? <laughs> yeah. Sad face on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, can you? I can't. <laughs> I'm going to try. <laughs> no, no, don't. Don't, don't, like, don't do it. Uh, you just lean forward, get stuck forward. Like Look, that. I'm yeah. through, right through the staircase. <laughs> Into the basement. He's in the oil tank. <laughs> He's in the oil tank like it's a bathtub. <laughs> wow. Uh, hey, Nick and Chris, can't wait for Minneapolis. Uh, while you're in Minnesota, check out Ramsey Pawn for some new pew pews. Oh, uh, sick. MD, MD discount for my guys. What's the name of the place? Uh, Ramsey Pawn. We will go and buy guns at Ramsey Pawn and bring them back. And bring them back on the plane. <laughs> as long as we'll you bring it. I bought them in Minnesota. What? <laughs> They're in my 
Check back. Carry on. You can't do that. They're from Ramsey's. I put the clip in my pocket and the the gun in my uh up in the contain. What the fuck is the problem here, guys? <laughs> what are we talking about? I put it through the sc the scanner with my watch and my fucking belt. Yeah, there's no bullets. There's no bullets in it. I fucking I'll buy them when I get home. Oh, there's one in it. Oh, oh Jesus. That's nice. that's a an honest mistake. Not news to me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we were shooting it out of the window the day we bought it. <laughs> um, I had to. I have to move for the job, and I'm thinking about moving there with my best friend. But that friend plays MMOs all day and does nothing with his life. I want him to be around, but I don't know. Whew. Tough one. That is tough. Get a fancy apartment where you don't have to see him. <laughs> Make sure that whatever apartment you do end up getting with your friend, because you're a loyalist. <laughs> but do you have to move with the friend? Right. Yeah. I mean, I mean you have to move for the job. It's Kyle. <laughs> yeah. We've been boys for 12 years. We've been boys for two, two years. <laughs> yeah. Well, he needs me. We met on <laughs> we we met on Xbox. He needs me. He's like never even said any words. He's like Oh, than, we're moving. Shut up. <laughs> moving how far? Okay. Yeah. When do I have to have my stuff out? <laughs> what? I got the master. <laughs> <laughs> Good room's mine. He hasn't even seen any listings yet. <laughs> Good room's mine is funny. Uh, <laughs> um, I would recommend not doing that, but congratulations on the job offer and doing yes. that. You probably Hell should yeah. take it. You know, seize the opportunity. It was three fifty a month, and one of my boys was like, just going through a rough patch. And he's like, "This. What do you want me to say? I don't have any money." I'm like, "I'm like twenty two with a mortgage." But all in all, I'm so on. I'm so far over the fence, and he's. There should be an in between. Like I, I am way too freaking. Yeah. You know. You're like whatever. Dude. This is what it is. Yeah. I have my dad in my ear like this. You like getting ripped off by your friends? Yeah, yeah. He's like he feeds it. He's he's lighting gas on my fire. He's basically <laughs> telling me to fucking knock my friends out. Yeah, or, or, like, or, or I'll do it. It's just I don't understand why people don't rip, if they're friends. Why would they rip you off like that? So I just wonder like if someone stole money out of your pocket, would you knock them out or would you let them take it? So you know what you got to do then. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> he's like this. Damn. Walks out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like this. Yeah, you're right. And then I'm just like, what the <laughs> am I doing? He fires you up. Yeah, yeah. And Nick, I, I know you can take Dean. <laughs> You've got 45, 50 pounds on him. You'll crush him. One punch. He's my boy. Do yeah, me man. a favor. Call me when you do it. Oh, send me a picture of him when he's knocked out on the ground with a broken nose. That's That'll all. teach him. Maybe he'll find the 500 bucks then. Yeah. How many months is it? Two months? <sighs> that stings. Oh, wow. That's going to hurt, huh? Interest. Um, and how much wins he going to pay the interest on that? Okay, cool. And the car rental now? <laughs> all right. So does he have the title for his car? Why don't you just get that then? Ask the Guido <laughs> girl to do a Jim Carrey impression, and it was 10 times more funny than you said it would be. Yes. Did you record it? No, what is that? So, so it's not even funny. It's just a movement that I'm trying. I'm going to say it everywhere. I want Guido girls. <laughs> I already know it's funny. It is funny. To do Jim Carrey impressions to each other. To have it be like a cultural thing. To be like, Ashley, get off the phone. Where are you? And she's like, <laughs> like, I'll fucking die if that becomes like, like if I see like Snooki being like, oh yeah, smoking. <laughs> like, what are you, what are you girls outside doing? You drinking Pinot Grigio and smoking? It's, it's just so polar opposite of a Guido girl. It's like walking around yep. like Jim Carrey. Like, I think it's the funniest fucking thing. You yeah. have the duff it, like trying to pull it off. Yeah, try, like, they're bad at, they're like, I don't know, like, Guido's kind of forcing their friend to partake in the hobby yep. where one of them is not that good at it and she's like I don't know uh, alrighty then <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah that's yeah. pretty good that's like, so specific it's so good man yeah. I, I, I think about it all the time because <laughs> it would like really I feel like it's like the bonding it's like the the <laughs> loosening up of cultural culture it's like culture conditioner bringing the world together yes yeah I feel like if like two black ladies saw two Guido girls talking like Jim Carrey, mm -hmm. they're all going out for fucking. They're Pino all going to a tool funniest that. thing they've ever. Then seen. they all go to a Tool concert. Yeah. Forty <laughs> <laughs> six and two. Yeah. Just like, <laughs> that's, yeah, like it's a Guido girl. I, I can't stop <laughs> I thinking of that. That's so funny. Yeah. yeah. Who is that? <laughs> Like, yeah, everybody has their own Jim Carrey. Yeah, like, yeah. there are four lines of Jim yeah, Carrey. Yeah. <laughs> like, everybody's got all righty yeah. then. I looked up, like, people doing Jim Carrey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're in PR, baby. Baby, like, speaking of it, we're in the Cabo, Cabo, Cabo Rojo, which means Red Cabo. <laughs> <laughs> Puerto Rico 00623, which is interesting that we run zip codes. Honey, go to the Hong Kong. 
and get the red paint. <laughs> We're gonna paint this metal all the the Italian garden furniture, put it on the tire so it break the tire, scratch it loud. <laughs> if there's one thing that I like is putting you know what they say? R is for Rojo, S is for speakerphone. <laughs> <laughs> What is this guy like? <laughs> Holy this shit. This guy likes not being able to walk around in his house. Uh, it's, a sanct it's, a, it's a special place. It's got the magic in what it. What the hell are we looking at? It's, this place is littered. Look at all. What's the, what, are, what are all these little winged? Like, uh, yeah. What are those little things in like South America? They're like gnomes. Oh, this has got some magic in this house. <laughs> I don't you know if I want to be talking about this house. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah this know. voodoo. This is like, uh, we're, we're lynching for love. Whatever that. One girl claims she could do. Yep. This uh, this guy. <laughs> He's like, ah, yeah, ah. this guy. Oh, that guy. That guy owns this house. He took the money that he got from Bloodsport, and uh, he he got it. That's the guy who owns this house. That's what he yeah. says when you buy it. This is the guy. This is the guy. I think as soon as he says, <laughs> as soon as he says yeah. fight, he gets his ass kicked. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, like immediate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, oh, cool. That, that's all good. One second in. That's actually the best part right here. Okay, boom. <laughs> Right away. <laughs> yeah, that's how they set that shot up. They're like, all right, and just go ahead and kick him in the head. Yep. This guy doesn't speak anything. All right, John Claude, why don't we have you step in and just kick this guy in the head? <laughs> <laughs> it's like two hours of him doing the. But no, that now that guy is gonna. I'm gonna get a curse now. I feel like we're gonna. I, I feel energy coming off that listing for the first yeah, time. More than that damn eclipse. <laughs> more than yeah, more than that damn eclipse. I honestly, I think the CERN just opened up. I can't. I'm sorry. I know you're trying to cast spells. 311's great. I just. Ugh. It's not I an even feel field. It. It's not. I'm getting magnetic waves out of this thing. I think you spent some time in that pool outside. That's about it. Yeah, washing off. It's holy water. Went from living in my car to selling them. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. MD never dies. Now that's a sales pitch I can get behind. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. you think you're killing the sale? Like, you think you're nailing it? And you're like, I went from living in my car to selling them. And you smile at them. You realize you have no teeth and you're talking to a wall. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a go. You're not talking to anybody? You're shaking a dumpster's yeah. hand? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have you met my son? Yeah. <laughs> it's a lighter. Nothing worse than a tight neck. Oh, it's the worst. That is, the, it'll ruin the whole day. Oh, dude. It's the worst. And then, or, or buying by brand, like Italian, like, I started to make like a decent paycheck at Mercedes. I'm like, I'm gonna buy fucking Italian shirts. Like, Cesare Adelini, you get Italian fit shirts. They're so fucking tight, they're like this. <laughs> They're made for like torsos that are like twink torsos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm buying like I'm finally saving up like two hundred dollars to buy like a nice button down mm -hmm. shirt. Because I notice people like picking my shirts up. People be like, Oh, where'd you get that? Like I'd have cashmere on, they'd yeah. be like, Oh Mercedes people are twats, they do it. So I'm like, oh, I better get some nice shit. I get nice shit, it fits me like a twink. Oh my god. Know your shirt size, buddy. I know like the in, in between buttons. Yeah. I'm yeah. wearing it anyway because I can't afford not to. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like as well, it's still fucking it's Cesare Adelini, you fucking idiot. <laughs> and, it, and this you fits. Don't say that. It's a twelve hundred dollars shirt, you fucking moron! It does. It's like the buttons are shooting so, off. Yeah, it fits around. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it fits like this. <laughs> yeah, nice try, asshole. Yeah. Okay, it's fucking super one twenties. You can't. Please, these are hand knit. I uh, I see a foundation after this thing's torn down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, That's what I is, see. This is the this this might arguably. This is probably the biggest piece of shit. You see how short the ceiling is? Yeah, we went with a five and a half foot ceiling. Oh, that's plenty. <laughs> it's it's fun. plenty to just suck getting the door in. Because we had to chop the aluminum <laughs> door in half. You can tell like the panels halfway cut through. <laughs> it's like open on the top, the aluminum <laughs> chewed through. Yeah. You can tell he like tried to cut it with tin snips. It's, it's a hollow door and you can just, you can, you can open it by <laughs> sticking yeah. your fingers in. Yeah, it's like when it gets breezy, it's like there's like an air pocket in it when uh, when wind hits the front of it. I know the cut could have been better, but <laughs> I didn't have any tools. <laughs> I had to do it with a flathead screwdriver and a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> I had to cut it with a car jack. <laughs> now, I'm glad that you had enough time to put the Coca-Cola border up. It goes shows that your dedication to having fucking blue feet diabetes and being a fat piece of shit wannabe porn star um, has outweighed uh, cleanliness in your home. But you had enough spooky clowns. <laughs> He's the one that put up the truth. <laughs> he, he put, put up, it up. He put up the board. He loves Coke. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> He's trying to sell you Osborne 200000 that's worth $15. It's a teardown. <laughs> He's 
<laughs> At least someone's honest around here. <laughs> <laughs> while the owner's like 450 pounds taking a huge shit while she's trying to sell with the door open. <laughs> Sorry, I, I gotta go. It's like, <laughs> like unloading, like bowel unloading shits with a clown mask on trying to sell you a fucking house. <laughs> but if the, 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 the more worrying concern is if this is your boss, what, uh, how much crystal meth can you cook in a fucking week? Right. Dude. Yeah, what is going on? What, yeah, what roller skating rink do you manage? <laughs> Type JJ twice in the chat if you're alive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My house is worth a million and it won't take any less. They're like, well, it comps out at 650, so now what? I'll list it myself. You know what? That's all you guys do. You just want to sell it for a price where it sells right away. You guys are in and out. You make your commissions and you're down the road. And that makes me sick. That's why I want a million. This is why everybody's a piece of shit and you have to be a skeptic always. Yep. Like, Fuck you, dude. Yep. Where are you going? You'll be sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when I, I commission free million, thank you. <laughs> um, stubborn dickhead boomers that are literally playing chicken with themselves, lying. It's a sign of the apocalypse, to be honest with you. Probably told their wife that they get a million for like five years. And then they came in and it was like, it's probably like 650, 700. Why don't you get out? <laughs> Isn't that what the realtor said, honey? It's like this, leave! <laughs> like a year later, they take the number. It's always the number. It's stubbornness. Um, and honestly, when you're selling, if I ever sell my house, I will. I, I hate getting top buck. I'm, I'm gonna, everything I price, everything I've ever sold in my life, priced to sell. I understand what it is. I'm not here to argue with you. I, I don't, I'm not gonna fix it. Or maybe I will. If I do make it perfect, I will want that number yep. within reason. You know what I'm saying? Like, fucking people are so bananas. Yeah. Oh, boomers are nuts. What salesman wants to talk to multiple people rather than just sell it? Yeah. Like, Here. who wants to waste the time? Yeah. Oh, well, you can get an extra, oh, if you can get an extra 100,000 uh, for waiting an extra few months, I think it's worth it. Yep. Three, you know, like, three years later, yeah. they get a gun in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, you know, all that kind of shit. Like, if I do whatever you want, you know, some people, um, I'll just do in like uh, people's variants of it's perfect. No, it's not. Uh, so, houses are literally like, it's like you could have a model that is into, it's like having sex with a model. Two ugly people who have <laughs> sex with a model are going to have completely different sex with this model. It may both be three minutes, but it's going to look <laughs> completely different. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you do doggy style? Missionary. One's Still a boob, different. One's a boob guy. One's an ass guy. <laughs> One's an ass guy, right? He's just like this the whole time. Uh, I've never done this. <laughs> yeah, she's ugly. She's right. you like this. Uh, yeah, that's what we're talking about. Uh, getting, getting ridden poorly. <laughs> Are you close? Like, like it hurts. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> were they, who was that? That house was a girl who. Uh... <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> grinding you. Yeah. Grinding. yeah. <laughs> That shit's mad. It's funny, bro. It's like the, the like the. It's a the, selfish <laughs> rider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a very uh, selfish rider. Like <laughs> that shit's so. Funny, it's bro. like the. It's like one of the the first hot <clears throat> chicks I ever hooked up with. It was, it was like that. Was like, <sighs> yeah. Does that feel good? Oh. You snap my dick off. <laughs> Get, leave. <laughs> That's so funny. I don't want to do this anymore. God, you got on hot quick. That's... It's like the equivalent of ugly crying, <laughs> but like it's it's fucking sick. <laughs> I used to ride horses, so I think I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. saying that often, you? Look at my head doesn't move. <laughs> I want it to move. <laughs> oh man, that's so funny. Pressing on your chest. Mm -hmm. Oh god. You're big yeah. and strong. I can put all 130 <laughs> pounds this. on you at all times. <laughs> I mean, congrats to fucking Eric. He's got the yeah. twin boys. Yeah. He's got now I'm a family of, uh, we got a family of five. I'm a father of three, which is awesome. That is fucking incredible, man. And yep. That's the incredible. Yeah. Family's all boys. Good. All boys, too. He's got a football team. They're all ready for construction. <laughs> <laughs> They're new Here's a shovel. Put them to work. Try this on. You handed him a whole shovel. He's one hour old. <laughs> you put like a, like a dirty sight shovel in the hospital with you. I'm like spades hurt. Ding. <laughs> you gotta watch out. You never want to step on these. These are nails. You put nails in the, <laughs> like in the, in the, the, your wife's bed. You're trying to take like obnoxious construction guy photos with your kids. <laughs> yeah. No, like, I know exactly. Like you're trying to take a picture with like your dirty boots. Yep. And like a shovel. Taking a knee with it. Get out of the way. You're being kind of a dick to the nurses. Get out of the way. We're breaking ground. <laughs> Here, bring in some of the dirt and put it around the baby. The baby's like, fuck, like one hour old. Like, 
covered in mud. He's eating covered dirt. in blue. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's stuff. Like, yeah, it's stuff. like stuff on. It's like, just get the dirt in here, the boots. He was get eating, my laser line. He's eating the chalk line. <laughs> just stupid. You don't eat that. It would be pretty funny if you did, though, you little No, 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 no. Let him learn. <laughs> And put him on the payroll, am I right? He's dying. He's dying. Yeah, leave him alone. <laughs> Valverde. I like the letting on Valverde. It looks like a yeah. Lamborghini. Yeah, exactly. Valverde. Right. No, I live up in the dealership. <laughs> <laughs> I live over there in the Valverde. Like, what do we believe in in Valverde? No windows! <laughs> when do we want them? Never! <laughs> Get out of here with those windows. What do you want to see inside my house, you pervert? Ah, just kidding. I don't have any windows. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I have windows to show the other part of my house. Hey, Frank, you want to come over and grill? We don't take no for an answer. <laughs> <laughs> Valverde forever. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Valverde. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Everybody's selling the neighborhood to everybody. Yeah, I'll see you back at Valverde, asshole. You'll be was, back. That wasn't really Verde of you. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go. There he goes, not being like he's like, well, I saw some windows there. There, there he goes, not being Valverde again. <laughs> Can't stand you, Cliff. <laughs> Brick it up. <laughs> Brick those windows. Yo, I didn't see. I saw a window truck. They they they, they hold the like. Say you're a window salesman driving your truck. Like you're driving your truck that way. And he's like this. <laughs> like it's just a hand kind of eating. They, they, they hate it. They fucking hate them. Like full on machine guns, like pointing at them, like immediately, like out of here. You know the drill. <laughs> the neighbor's like this. I haven't seen you in a while. He's like this. Yeah! <laughs> Everybody's like a lunatic in Valverde. <laughs> They're speeding all over town. Like they all have like Valverde license plate moniker, like things that you know they're from there. <laughs> they have like a uh, car gangs and they're speeding all over town. <laughs> they're not paying for groceries and shit. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Out of here. Anderson Windows, out of here, dickhead. Oprah's you out. <laughs> <laughs> Oprah's out. Take her with you. <laughs> this guy had a peeping Tom when he was a kid and it fucked them all. Not up. again. <laughs> Never again. <laughs> <laughs> never again. You're never gonna look at my mom in the shower again. It crushed me inside. Valverde! I, yeah, I overpaid for Verde. <laughs> so I'll see you back at Verde? All right, excellent. That's yeah. the style. So you do doll these up. That's, yeah. that's the plan. You make them like little little dolls. My little doll. <laughs> my little bait. Look, I like playing with dolls. <laughs> <laughs> my house, the doll, a little baby doll. I'm the annoying friend. I literally send him something every day. I'm like, hey, check this out. This one looks good. I throw big. my phone. I throw my phone right. When's it gonna work? I know. No and one. This is my response every time. No. Nice. No. I I'm know. Like, I'll hit you up tomorrow. Then I'll go fuck myself. Yeah. I dude, I get it. I, I'm actually shocked. I'm like this. Like people with rugs, they'll send me rugs that are like that aren't good. I'm like. Look at the ones I sell. I buy everything that I like that I sell that's that's good that that hits the market and sells right away. Just look at them. People are like, all right, got it. <laughs> That's like, me. Like, turn your head. I'll show you what people show. <laughs> this ought to be good. This is what people send me. They're like, got it. <laughs> tell me, is this worth anything? <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me, is this worth anything? It's kind of weird. The guy said it was from... Oh, that's so funny. It's every fucking day. It's <laughs> like the letdown so of your good. life. It's like if you told me to go find you, like, construction equipment, and then I came back with, like, um... I, I try to not be so retarded, too. I'm like this, all right. I got him this time. They said it was, like, a, a Kavlar something, blah, blah, blah. I search it for the size, yep. you know, 13 and a half by 24. It's like this. I'm saying 119 grand. I'm Whoa. Like, I'm like, this looks, this seems pretty good for 9K. I sent it to Nick. He's like, no. <laughs> Nice. Jesus. <laughs> Never mind. No, I'll, I'll, nope, I'll go fuck myself. How do you get up there? Climb. <laughs> I'm going to look up your skirt, though. <laughs> Ath athletic. <laughs> athletic. Athletic. <laughs> like, there's no way to get up there. No, you just I... have to climb. That's so funny. Athletic. <laughs> Widow speak. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to look up your dress. Just kidding. No, nah, it's not a big deal. <laughs> to say to the realtor, <laughs> like he's like a pervert with the realtor. He's I got goodies up top. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude, that's so fun. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> oh shit, my wife's here. <clears throat> down the pole. You can swing down. It's cool. I'll be laying on the bottom. 
yeah, yeah. Go down, but first. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let me get down. He runs down the stairs. He's like, <laughs> gets down. He's a fucking complete perv. He's like, he's uh, somehow the realtor's so stupid. She's going for it because it's a two and a half million dollar listing. <laughs> yeah. Scotch print carpet gym. Something the guy is a pervert. Yes. This guy is yeah, a pervert. Yeah, Anybody with a right. Yeah, dude. Yeah, on. that. Who's got that? Otherwise, I, dude, I've been seeing it a lot lately. I've been seeing perv houses like a lot, like massage. Like, oh, cool. Um, this is a nice house to get jerked off in. If you get this house, you're rich. <laughs> Very rich with <laughs> pleasure. <laughs> I hope you like pleasure. Welcome to my pleasure cat. It's a pleasure. <laughs> pleasure genitals. <laughs> I only buy big and chunky stuff. Yep. I used to get it in my store a lot. They'd like look for this like balusters, railings. Tw they like they were obsessed more with swirls, <laughs> more swir <laughs> swirlies. Because I'm a pretty princess. <laughs> yeah. More swirls. I want the whole house to be a conversation piece. Everywhere you go, it's gonna be swirls. Because when I'm because my princess castle. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want for? Uh, do you want chocolate vanilla or swirl? Swirl. <laughs> <laughs> Quit fucking with me, man. I come here every day. <laughs> what do people say when they go down my my uh, fireman's pole? <laughs> Just shut up and sit on the banister. Try it out. <laughs> Athletic. <laughs> yeah. A good rug is like a good woman. Iranian virgin and you change her every four years. Cool. You, this, um, <laughs> you, uh, I have a feeling if we'd meet, your cousin would tell me a story how he paid $40,000 to shit next to Lindsay Lohan in a hotel room. <laughs> Cause that makes sense. That's cool, brother. You know Lindsay Lohan? My cousin f her, bro. 10,000. <laughs> bro, my brother, my cousin take lumpy shit, turn uh, Arizona State cheerleader uh, into toilet. <laughs> uh, yeah, yachting is really rough on the girls. They say big money, I say huge humiliation. Ha 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 I win. <laughs> No rug. No new no. rug. So yeah, but I follow two Persian, uh, like new Persian silk rug makers. They make the ugliest fucking rugs. So, okay, yeah. So new shit socks. New shit. Um, so um, <laughs> this is what he's listening to. Yeah, he's like, you, why do you have battery ugly girl? No. Um, this is what this is the rug that the, the, the best the guy. Yeah, owned by this. What guy. do you mean you don't like it? This gold. <laughs> it rolls. What are life. you a fucking idiot? This is dope, bro. I got the flowers on the wheels. <laughs> It's an umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean it's not cool? It's dope. What are you, crazy? <laughs> I rode in parade. God, I feel like I'm fucking taking crazy pills over here. This thing's dope as shit. <laughs> I think Charleston's pretty hot. Um, you're going to want to do deal with the boutique companies flying drones through houses. These fucking luxury real estate agents love to be like, hey, come on in here. Take a look. Oh, it's a yeah. Magical place. Whoa! Like, like, <laughs> it's, it's like an attention thing. That's They love that. So, a small drone following the agent. Come on, come over here. He's like this. <laughs> <laughs> Get up, shut the door. Get closer. Blow my hair around. <laughs> Can the fans blow my hair? <laughs> That's what he asks you. Yeah. You <laughs> knock him out. Do one with a realtor where you follow him through. They will be blown away by that. That one shot. Come on out, 432 Simmons Avenue. Come on in. Wham, 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 bye, 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 bye. I worked in a dealership. It's like Mercedes, Audi, BMW, Lexus. Big thing. There's no truck, tractor trailer trucks you can bring down there. Like you can't get a there's, truck in, you'll, you'll get stuck. There's rotaries. Yeah, there's a rotary you'll get. And all the time these fucking Russian truck drivers, and they were fucking dickheads. They'd be like, where do I bring the car? Like we're running like eight deals. We're busy as shit. They're driving a tractor trailer truck full of Mercedes. Where I bring car? Why do I bring? But they, no English. Yep. And they'd walk in with a paper, and like headphones on, and my boss would be like, he'd call me on my thing, be like, Hey Nick, can you come up here and um, just give the guy directions for the a top lot? And I'd be like, Excuse me, guys, I have to go do something real quick. And I'd walk up, and uh, you hold the paper, and you just pretend like you're a Russian guy. So where do I go? It's like right over here. I sucked my dad's cock last night. Yeah. And like, yeah, right over here. It's like, you know, you're gonna have a whole mouthful of shit. But right up at the top, it's not a mile away. I'm like, no, no, you put your, like, what you do is you, you, know, you dig your tongue way up the ass when someone's taking a shit. It's that much easier. Because the, 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 it's gonna have a gate that opens up. And honestly, if you sit down, you can piss all over the bottom of your feet. Because you, yeah, honestly, it's probably like, it's probably your teeth rotting out of your mouth that stinks so bad. Right. But yeah. And then you just keep, you just keep. <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and then I would stop, and then my boss would come in and he'd be like this. He's like, listen, you, you, um, your 
fucking a, a <laughs> prostitute, a, a lot lizard prostitute. So, he, and we would bomb, and there would be like five people in the office and be like, <laughs> I can only imagine. It, like guys clawing on the ground to like stay in the room. They're like, Jesus Christ, stop doing it. All the time. And like we, you'd have to point and like shuffle the papers right. <laughs> and then bring your phone up and start like doing this kind of shit. That's so funny. It was Fuck. so much fucking fun. De um, delivering accurate information to the guy? Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's about a mile away, button. but if you sit on Fuck your you fingers the whole time, it. honestly, you probably have a fingernail on the thing. <laughs> you can put it right in your dick tip. But make sure you use a box cutter. Honestly, to slice her pussy off because it's about up the. <laughs> That's so funny. Fuck. That is funny. And so. there would be, uh, like fucking. I remember there's one of my other my other boss team. It's like two managers at a desk. My other boss would just be like. <laughs> he would get underneath his desk. Literally, he couldn't take it. He would literally like, crawl in the, like the knee pocket for his desk because he knew Damn. it was coming. Maybe yes. she maybe she babied you a little too much, and maybe. You, you took her old furniture and you told everybody it was worth a lot of money and you believed her because, well, you never really had to look left or right because they gave you money your whole life. And you soft, she softened you up like fucking dough. And now you're just dough watching your, your pretty <laughs> avid voice watcher. The voice? The voice watcher. Yeah. yeah. The, so, the masked singer? Yeah, yeah. You're, you know, you like, uh, what's his face? The Asian guy that my fucking wife hates. His, his stand-up. <laughs> probably the best I've ever heard. Oh, <laughs> Ken Jong, Jong, yeah, Jong. I was close. You were close. It's it's downright embarrassing. My wife's got a Ken Jong fucking rant that is so funny. Oh, she's yeah. she's like if you sit here and watch if Ken Jong, he's always like overacting. Like, oh my god! Oh, yes, he's he is the epitome of assuming everyone's gonna laugh at every joke. He, yeah, that's what it looks like. He's like Asian Jim Carrey when people hated Jim Carrey for overacting. Yep. Didn't Tommy Lee Jones tell Jim Carrey he fucking hates him? Yeah, During I, the Batman, I heard uh, Tommy Lee Jones is good. Yeah, as far as like uh, he he's not annoying, but I think he goes he goes to the director and tells him how to reshoot something. Oh this yeah, is that good? Yeah, he's like a real he's like a real actor. Yep. I think he pulled Jim Carrey and was like, I hate your guts. Really? I hate the way you deliver your lines. Like he's like, I don't like you. He I remember like Jim Carrey was telling I don't the story. Find you funny? Yeah. Like, imagine being sick of Jim Carrey as Tommy Lee Jones. Well, that's what Ken Jong is, and in, uh, in the whole the whole rest of the world, <laughs> mansion, <laughs> mansion. Oh, I mean, this is this is my house when I was a kid. I don't get it. Yeah, <laughs> but I mean, it's, just a humble, it's just a humble house. And you used to commute from Miami. <laughs> I like JoJo Siwa is uh, she's like a Jake Paul test tube mutant that's dressed as like a as Lord Zed's girlfriend Rita's wife. <laughs> Rangers, <laughs> like this kind of shit. Like, yeah, she dresses like like Jake Paul test tube is funny. Jake Paul test tube Rita's daughter is JoJo Siwa. Yeah, I'm sure that the, the Nickelodeon did a fun time trying to kick a telephone pole up her ass from the time she was born. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> you know, I'm sure of it. Yeah, Nickelodeon it's was like, oh, cool, oh, great. That's that's all they do is they poke their head up over computers. Like, oh, cool, little blonde girl, get the telephone pole. <laughs> 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 Shoot her mom. Give her mom the ten grand. Get her, get her out of there. Give her mom ten grand. Go lease her mom a, a, a Mercedes convertible. Go go. Get the telephone pole. Let's do this. Oh, oh hey, we got some. Hey, we got some songs for you. We got some songs for you. Yay! Yay! That's that's how Nickelodeon works. That's, like, that's that's how you train a Nickelodeon executive. Yay! Hey, we have some songs to go up, up here, up here, up here, up here. Look, 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 look. Yeah, yeah. We're like a wife beater with like stains on it. Yeah. Ooh. Face paint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Over here, over here, honey. Over here. Here's ten thousand dollars. You're five. Thank you. Ten thousand dollars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's Nickelodeon Monday morning. <laughs> You're famous. You're famous. Shooter with Gak. Dan, get in here. Check this out. He's like. Rah. Rah. That's so awesome. Children. Yeah. Uh.